Hello, my wonderful women. You often write letters to me and say everything seems to be fine. My partner and I have met, fallen in love, everything is good. I wish this state of things lasted throughout my life, but no. After one, five, seven years, it seems that old feelings are gone. What can we do to return an eternal honeymoon to the relationship? Or is it impossible? Beloved women, I want to tell you that it is possible. I want to tell you a story of my student, Elizabeth. She met her husband about 10 years ago when they were young, full of strength and energy. She is 36 years old now, and she is thinking, I've gone through so much in my life. At some point, I realized that my husband and I had become total strangers. Quarrels and conflicts started arising. I used different methods to solve the problem. I visited the psychologist and had a heart-to-heart -heart conversation with him, but nothing worked. The distance between us seemed to be getting larger and larger. And then she wrote a letter to me and asked what to do. I looked at the results of the diagnostics and saw that she had lost the luminosity of her womb. The energy had disappeared. You may ask how to return it. I think that many of you have asked this question, how to make relationships with your partner always interesting, always funny, always enriching. And then I advised a very ancient temple ritual. It is womb breathing, bioenergetic breathing. At the end of this video, I will tell you how to perform it properly together, become filled with energy every day, and be always interested in your partner. So she came to me for diagnostics, and I saw that her luminosity had gone away, exactly at the age of 36, on her birthday. And it has been happening to her lineage for 12 generations. At exactly 36 years old, women lose their womb luminosity due to a very ancient karmic curse. When luminosity goes away, a woman is no longer longer interesting to her partner. He simply does not notice her. Then we started performing a special ritual of womb cleansing and an exercise I will talk about a little later. Many women address me and say, I desperately want my partner to always look at me with admiration. Beloved women, this is special sacral knowledge about how to keep your relationship for 20, 30, 50 years. Do you think it doesn't happen? My student, who is 74 years old, still continues heating her partner's imagination. He never knows what she will be like today, and she is new every time, a new image, a new condition. He says with admiration, what will she be like today? I want to tell you that it is real for you as well. We will be making your womb incredibly luminous and attractive. Have you heard of Cleopatra? Everyone mentions Cleopatra, but very few people know that according to the canon of that time and our time as well, she was not, to put it mildly, very pretty but she had great womb luminosity, and she was a priestess, and she knew how to use such energy. At one of the lessons of my online course, Return of Sacral Female Power, I will share this knowledge with you. For over 20 years, I have been collecting all this knowledge to transfer it to you. I have collected all the best together, the most powerful and effective practices. We will be obtaining knowledge about how to make the womb luminous and return everything to your life. You're looking forward to finding out the advice I gave to Elizabeth, aren't you? I know. Well, for that we'll perform the first exercise. Rub your palms intensely. Rub them together. Are they hot? No? Rub more intensely then. It should just burn as this energy is your power. Well done. Open your palms. Do you feel tingling? Maybe heat? But if you don't feel anything, that's okay. You'll learn to feel it. Well, we have formed a ball of energy. Now, let's take a breath and put it into the womb. Take a breath. Breathe this energy in. 
Breathe out and feel the energy spread throughout the womb and ovaries in a pleasant way. Rub again. Form the ball of energy again. Someone already has a big ball, right? The more energy there is, the bigger the ball is. We take a breath again, then exhale and spread the energy in the womb. You can perform this exercise 3, 7, 12, 21 times. You will have so much energy. Please, save your partner. He may not be able to bear this power. Let's start with at least 7 times. Add more and more each time. Well, what do you feel? By the way, you can use a mirror. Do your eyes speak? It's a very good result. Do you want to move, dance? That's wonderful. Beloved women, we have done it. I also want to share a simple but very effective method with you. Please, tell me when the last time you thanked your partner was. Never at all? Nothing to thank them for? Beloved women, I want to tell you that gratitude is one of the most important female qualities. Imagine that if you thank God, spirits, angels, your partner in full with great power of dedication, they also want to help you in full. Do your best. Thank God. God, thank you for the situation of my life. God says, she thanks me. I will give her everything she asks for. Thank your partner. Thank you for being in my life. Partner thinks, what a wonderful woman I have. I'll do everything for her. And he does. A task for you. We are starting a 10-day gratitude marathon. Can we endure it? I think 10 days are easy for us. Write down 10 things you are grateful for, what your partner has taught you. If you say nothing, I won't believe you. God connects us with people so that we could learn something from each other. First, write down what you thank your partner for. You've managed it. Well done. And now, say one thank you to your partner every day. Each of these 10 days, we can do it. We'll do it with you even more than 10 days. It has to be a new gratitude each time. Start thanking every day. You may do it silently, but first class performance is to thank out loud. Say to your partner, you know, I'm so grateful for you for minutes of happiness, hours of happiness. Remember a story. For example, I'm grateful that you let me love you. You should agree that it is really great gratitude. I'm grateful for all the flowers you gave me, for the attention you gave me, for our travels. He may have taught you something and it became your hobby. Always thank him. And in 10 days, you will notice what has happened to your partner. He may thank you as well. Maybe there will be gifts. Or he may want to take you somewhere. He will say, I appreciate you as much as I love you. You are the most precious thing I have in my life. Darlings, if it doesn't happen the first time, don't be discouraged. Maybe you chose the wrong words of gratitude or said them in the wrong mood. For example, you came and said, well, thank you. Thank you for being in my life. I really ask you to say it sincerely. Say it from your heart as purity of your heart. Your great love can create new relationships. And if you want new relationships, you have to make a little effort. You will definitely succeed. I certainly want to share other secrets and stories to inspire you, but I will do it in my online course, Return of Sacral Female Power, as this is what I live for, to give you the state of happiness, to transfer power to your lineage, to unlock your talents and superpowers, I'm looking forward to sharing the most intimate things I have in my heart with you. Attention. 
the protective amulet and the right that you will be given at our seminar will help you to stand against all the problems of the family, cleanse your karma, and open the way to a bright future. The amulet and protective right are necessary for you.